tears, hugs, and gasps as the family of Sierra Joggin heard the jury recommendation of the death penalty. The Honorable Jeffrey Robinson asking the jury for its recommendations. After the death penalty decision, he pulled each one, four men and eight women. It was a show of purple with Sierra Joggin's loved ones wearing her favorite color as they have every day of this four-week trial. Her uncle saying Sierra's family had been put in the worst position, having to bury a young woman with her life ahead of her and grieve her. You know, we're not a family that would wish for this, but we felt the jury reached the appropriate verdict. Earlier, the judge hearing from witnesses, including Worley's older sister, friends, and a criminal psychologist for insight into his mind and his past. The defense team trying to convince the jury to spare Worley's life after being convicted on all 19 counts for the murder of Sierra Joggin. I'm asking you to consider putting him there, there, so you can think about this every day for the rest of his life until he dies in prison. But the prosecution arguing James Worley was in his right mind and tried to cover up his crime. He must get the death penalty. He chose to attack Sierra on County Road 6. He chose to transport her from that location to his barn. He chose to strip her of her clothing and dress her up in pornographic wear. He chose to tie her up and hog tie her in the manner in which he saw on the pornographic videos he watched. He chose all of those things. The jury siding with the prosecution and helping the family inch closer to justice for Sierra. The Honorable Jeffrey Robinson sentences James Worley on April the 18th. Reporting at the Fulton County Courthouse, I'm Viviana Hurtado, WTOL 11 News.